The girls bowling scene is quite competitive in Naperville and Neuqua Valley is no stranger to that idea. But this year they feel that they're doing everything they can to sit at the top of the charts. Learn more about just how they're doing that in this team profile presented by Molly Maids of the Aurora Naperville area. The Neuqua Valley girls bowling team has never won conference until now. Everything is, I mean, it, it's a big thing when this will be the first time in our history in the 16 years that I've been coaching that we've ever had the chance of winning, of winning the conference because it's always been either Lake Park or Wabonzi or even like St. Charles. We do know that we're in first and we're leading the DVC, which is awesome and we're really excited about that. But when it comes time to that position round, all of those thoughts have to go out of our head because you do have to stay in the moment, especially with this sport. It's very much in the moment. In order to stay on top, the team works hard at practice, doing things that not many people actually realize happen at bowling practice. I think the biggest thing that people don't realize is the stamina that you need to be at these bowling tournaments. We do a lot of wall sits, which we hate doing wall sits, so it works. Um, today we're starting to do crunches if we miss spares. It's just having kind of like, it sounds bad, but like that fear factor. So we kind of have to do those like little mini workouts. It's just kind of incentives um, to try to do better and like try to get better overall. Because if we're motivated that we don't want to do like wall sits or something, then we're probably going to be a little bit more motivated to try to get better or like help each other if we're do getting down. Hannah Breyer and Sheila Sutfin are the two seniors on the varsity team and Coach Lotak looks to them to throw the ball in the right direction, which they seem to be doing quite well. Uh, well, both of them are, have their very unique personalities. So she got the two different aspects of, of both sides of it. So Sheila's that, that almost that, that positive, that person that's like, this is what you gotta do to compete. This is what we need to do. Kind of like the, the bearer of bad news. And Hannah's kind of like, Yes, but let's be positive about it. Let's, let's, like, she will cheer if she's having the worst day. Even if the two seniors differ in their leading styles, there's one thing that they agree on. The biggest goal is to go to state. It's something since my freshman year, it's like looking towards senior year, I want to be at state with my team. Last year we got to sectionals for the first time as a team total, and then this year we knew that we really had a good chance about getting to state. So I think that's our ultimate goal is getting to state, but first we just have to focus on uh, each tournament as it comes and then try to get there. If they bowl the way that I've seen them bowl in the tournaments, if they actually are consistent, like I've seen them bowl in practice, like I've seen them bowl against Andrew and everything else, I think they do have a good chance of going. And if they have confidence in themselves, like I have confidence in them, I think they should be able to go to state. The journey to state begins on February 3rd with regionals, but until then, the team will be crunching and wall-sitting their way through practice in hopes of reaching their goals.